Okay, now we're going to go on to our script that we filled out yesterday. Um, remember, we had the this the conversation between Amy and Sheldon. And so go ahead and get that out, and we're going to look at that for a few minutes. Okay, so what we're going to talk about right now is a pronunciation. So one of the combinations of letters that we have a lot throughout this script is the TH. And uh, so the way we pronounce that is th, th, like the and with. So it's your, your tongue is up on your teeth with, and the back of your throat is relaxed with. So uh, I, it's, it seems kind of weird just trying to do it by itself, but we're going to try it with words. So don't worry, it's going to be easy. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to take our script that we got of Amy and Sheldon discussing the place to, or the video games, and we're going to look at the words with TH and make sure we pronounce them right, okay? So if we look at the first sentence in the script, it is, first there was PlayStation, a.k.a. PS1. So which word has the TH sound in it in that, in that sentence? Exactly. There. There was. The. The. There. So everybody try saying that. There there say it in the whole sentence first there was playstation aka ps1 okay that's good so now we know that if you're saying it at the front of the word it sounds the same Th there all right and let's look at the second sentence then there's ps2 ps3 and now ps4 so what are the words in that sentence that start there that have th in them? Then and theirs, yes. So then theirs. So it's still the th. It's just not. It's not as long. So like when we practice it as an isolated sound, we say th. th, th. It's really just a quick th, like then and there. So. What we're going to do is we're going to do one more sentence and then we're going to do some practicing on our own in groups. So let's look at the next sentence and that makes sense. Is there a TH word in that sentence? And that makes sense? That, exactly. So and that makes sense. So the th that is still the same. Your tongue is up by your teeth and your back of your throat is relaxed. It's that. So you guys are doing good. I think you've really got a handle on this. So what we're going to do is we're going to do some practice. We're going to get in our one, two groups. So if you're a one, make sure you get with a two. And the ones are going to be Amy. And the twos are going to be Sheldon. And we're just going to practice this script. So you're going to read it word for word. And just pay attention and when you get to those words that have TH in them, and make sure you're pronouncing it correctly. So, you know, if you make a mistake, you make a mistake, and most people are not going to be like, oh, you made a mistake. So <laughs> it's okay. But um, it, helps, it helps our communication if we pronounce things correctly, because that way people are better able to understand us. And sometimes if you pronounce things incorrectly, they not only don't know what you're saying, but it can also distract from the conversation. So that's why it's important to make sure we try to pronounce things correctly. So, and this of course is the US English pronunciation for words that we're using in this class. Okay, so get in your one, two groups. If you're a one, get with a two. If you're a two, get with a one. And then the ones are gonna be Amy and the twos are gonna be Sheldon. And you're just gonna go through the script. And then if you have any questions or if you need any help, I'll be walking around the room. Um, don't be afraid to ask. Remember, that's our number one rule. Questions are good, so always ask them. 
Um, I don't want you to be confused. Um, it's okay if you have trouble or if you need help. Um, so just ask for it. And then once you go through the entire script, um, I want you to give feedback to each other. You can also give feedback along the way. So if you're saying a sentence, you're saying, um, and that makes sense, and the that is good, it's okay to give good feedback to your partner and say, hey, that was really good. Or if they didn't quite get it right, you can say, maybe we should try that again. But let's not be rude to each other, okay? We're always going to be kind. But um, make sure you give especially some positive feedback. So we're just going to practice this. It's all going to go well. If you have any questions, ask. And I will be coming around the room and checking up and helping out. And, and it's all going to be fun. Okay, so let's get started. Everybody get in your one-two groups.